Why couldn't you just listen? Why couldn't you just stay away from the people who want to take you from me? Don't you know I love you more than anything? I would protect you forever and ever and ever and do anything for you. But you don't seem to get that, do you? Because if I can't have you, no one can. Aww, you're awake. What did I tell you about pulling on the chains? You stop it. Good, good. Anyway, you didn't hear that, did you? I take by your silence, that means no. Okay, good. It's about time you were starting to wakey-wakey. I was getting worried that I hit you too hard. You know, I would never hurt you intentionally, but you were just so stubborn this time, and you didn't want to drink the tea I made for you. It would have been a lot easier to just drug you than to hit you, but you left me no choice. How's your head? Stop squirming. I need to clean your wound. It's bleeding quite a lot, actually. I'm so sorry that I had to hurt you. You know, I love you so much. And I would never do that without reason. <sighs> the silent treatment again, I see. <laughs> well, we'll see how long that lasts this time. I thought I had taught you respect. Guess we'll have to be more aggressive this time. This is alcohol. I stole it from the infirmary. Because that's how much I care about you. Now, you need to stay still and I'll be gentle, okay? More gentle than your head was. I'm I told you not to squirm. Do I have to hold you still? Oh. Hold still. See, it's not so bad. Trust me, 
There's way more painful things that exist in this universe. Like jumping in a titan's mouth. Or like how much you disobey me. Or how much you hurt me by what you did. <sighs> now, can I bandage it? All better. Oh, I'm so glad. <laughs> You're so adorable. You're less adorable in chains, however. I just can't afford to take that risk. You can't behave, and you don't obey me. I'm going to teach you respect, however, and maybe, one day, I'll let you out of these chains, and that'll lead to, eventually, I'll let you out of the dungeon, and then, we can live happily, happily, ever after like we had both originally planned to do. Then maybe we'll go on cute dates, just like we used to. We'll get married, have a few kids, make love every single night. Doesn't that sound great? Hey, 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 what's wrong? You don't, you, you don't look so good, baby. Hey, stay awake, please. I, I've been feeding you regularly and giving you plenty to drink. I don't see why you're feeling this way. Here. Here, please, please, drink up. There you go, there you go. Come on, drink, drink, drink. Are you back with me? If you're not going to respond, then let me just check your pupils. You see? You look better. You really freaked me out there. You see? I really care about you. You know that? You, you must know that, right? Okay, now, you do know why you're here, don't you? <sighs> oh, that's okay. We can play the silent game all day long. That just means you do know why we're here then. If you don't, I'll make it even clearer for you. You lied to me. 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 Out of all people, me. <laughs> hmm. 
Aww. <laughs> Am I frightening you? Huh? Am I frightening you? Aww, baby. Don't cry. You hear that? That's the sound of nothing. Because Jean has mysteriously been missing ever since I let him go. Now, you can tell me the truth or you can continue playing this silent game with me. However, if you tell the truth, I might be a little more considerate with you. So, what's it going to be, baby? <laughs> I've had enough with the silent treatment. You're going to learn to fucking respect me. You hear that? Respect. But we'll get to that in a second. For right now, are you sure that you want to keep playing the silent game with me? <laughs> okay. Why did you lie to me? See? I know you didn't consensually do things with Jean because one, you like girls. And hey, it's okay if you like guys too, but you better not like horses. And two, the last time I checked, you liked a girl. You were supposed to love her. Do you know who her is? Her is me. If you love me, then why would you lie to me? To protect a coward, a man, if I can even call him that, no, a boy who took advantage of you, my precious, <laughs> it's not fair, no, 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 no. 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 I'd hardly. I'd hardly call that love. Now he's missing, and I. I can't even find him. Oh, the things I'd do to him. Maybe even kill him. You, you, <laughs> you did not just say that. You love me? Huh? 
Stop saying it. After all I've done, you still love me? Prove it. I want you to prove that you love me. <laughs> that was pretty good, but I don't know if it was good enough proof. <laughs> that was rough. But, I guess that's proof enough. <laughs> well, you better fucking love me after everything I did for you. I did it all for you. Was to keep you safe. Keep you from him. You see why I did this? Because you're mine. You know that? Mine, mine, mine. Mine. And you need to learn respect. You can't just kiss me and expect everything to go back to normal. You can't expect me to forget what you did. So, I want you to get up, get on your knees, and I want you to beg. <laughs> because I fucking said so. Don't ask questions. <laughs> you see, this is exactly the behavior I'm talking about, baby. You're misbehaving, and I can't fucking stand it, so get on your knees. Now, I want you to beg, beg for my forgiveness, and call me master while you do it. Don't ever question my authority again. You are going to listen to me and show me respect. Now, beg. Now, who do you belong to? I can't hear you. Good. You're such an obedient little slave. Now, I'm going to remind you who you belong to every single day. You hear me? Just in case you forget. I'm also going to be on the loose, looking for Horse Boy. And before you say anything, I want to remind you who's in charge and who you're talking to. Good. 
Now come here, baby. Take your food for tonight. And please, eat it this time. I'm not trying to have my baby suffer. Now come here. Thank you for beginning to learn. I'm glad you are finally becoming a good little pet. Now, I've got to go now, baby. Continue to be a good obedient pet while I'm gone. I'll be back in the morning and get some sleep. It's too late for you to be up anyway. I love you.